All right, we got Sid, so how do we use him to get Matt? Um, are you really sure about this? I mean, I know he can help, but it's Matt Miller. Kenzie, if he can help us find the others, then yes, I'm certain. Now, how does this work? Well, I give Sid the proper cipher to connect to Matt's personal simulation, and he opens the gateway. All right, let's go get the kid, then. I need to get my oil changed. On to the next! shift. shocked when the boss picked you to be the vice president, but you ended up working out. That's a Matt Miller, self-proclaimed hacker guy, ran all the cyber terrorism for the syndicate back in Steelport. Now he's Asha's right-hand man in MI6. Kinsey, how am I supposed to rescue Matt without a weapon? Well, you don't have superpowers either. Whoa, 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 whoa. Why the fuck are there giant words in my face? It's a command prompt. Just give me a second. Ah, hell, not again. Damn it! The camera's screwed up. I just have to deal with it. <gasps> this ain't my first time at the top-down tank rodeo. Kenzie, you gonna fix this or what? I'm trying, but I'm not used to the code they're using. Give me a second. Is anyone counting these kills? <laughs> Simple as 3D? No, 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 don't put in a space. Oops, sorry. 
Sorry, finger slipped. Finally. There should be three data towers controlling the security to Matt's prison. Then I just blow this thing up, right? Well, I wouldn't want you to go outside your comfort zone. I must say, I am amused at this attempt to save a man who tried to kill you once. <laughs> Actually, twice. No, three times. All the same, what is it you hope to accomplish? Mr. Miller is beyond your help. But what do you care if I try? <sighs> Very well. Your futile attempts do entertain me, after all. So close! Lots of firepower here, Kinsey. Destroying the tower should destroy the tanks with it. Miss Kensington is rather astute for a human. Yeah, well, big towers controlling security on a linear path. Not very creative for your superior intelligence. Ugh. That's two. One more to go. Oh, wanted to thank you, by the way, Kinsey. For what? Well, I'm in cyberspace and I haven't been turned into a sex doll or a toilet. But... God, are you still mad about that? I said I was sorry. Something that kind of sticks with you in your nightmares. Did that guy skip combat training? Last tower's going down. Oh, I don't think it should be that easy for you. You've made the tower invulnerable. Hang on, I'll find a workaround. Kenzie's recording this. I'm getting swarmed here. Wait, let me try something. I am impressed by Miss Kensington. Though this attempt is as futile as the life of most humans. Oh, look, an alien with a superiority complex. Surprising. Though this sentiment comes from more than just the zin, my dear. Tomorrow, and tomorrow, and tomorrow creeps in this petty pace from day to day. To the last syllable of recorded time. And all our yesterdays have lighted food. The way to dusty death. Out, out, brief candle. Life's but a walking shadow. A poor player that struts and frets his hour upon the stage. And then is heard no more. It is a tale told by an idiot. Full of sound and fury. Signifying nothing. <laughs> what idiot said that? It's a quote from Macbeth. Then yeah, no.
coming up on Matt's prison. And how am I getting him out without any weapons or a key? Chances are it's not a standard behind bars sort of prison. You'll just have to wing it. Normally you yell at me when I wing it. Oh, and since I can't see what's going on in there, Dad will be able to help you either. You just keep those reassurances coming. Before you, I place a choice. Walk through the blue door and continue to face yet more failures at saving those closest to you. Your race will live road time and will, through your violent arrogance, wind up extinct. Walk through the red door, however, and I will release the humans whom I have collected. I will give them amnesty and even a ship from my fleet to do with as they see fit. However, in choosing this door, you will willingly submit yourself to execution. This is the moment where you can prove to be the savior of humanity, or its absolute destroyer. What the hell is all this? This is your life as it led you to this point. All your past violence, crimes, and losses on display to remind you of one simple fact. Regardless of what I have done to your world, you were its greatest threat. Childhood? Wait, is that Matt? Trapped in technology he doesn't understand, in a cyber world he can't control. Don't worry, Matt. I'll get you out. Without Miss Kensington. Very doubtful. Behold my empire. Not very big. This is but a glimpse of what I have conquered. Ah, yes. I'm quite proud of this one. What am I looking at? Terror, as personified by your literary culture. A dead pirate with a black parrot? It's a raven. Yeah, but why does the pirate have a raven? <sighs> um, hi. All right, just pick up the phone and we'll get you out of there, Matt. like the idea of us sitting around. Shouldn't we be picking up Matt? The kid could be in trouble.